Hey everyone, it's me, Rachel Baker. In this video, I'm going over some facts about being quarantined in Italy, and I'll also be showing you some ways Emma and I are staying busy while being isolated. February 25th marked the first day that our schools closed. Um, we were a little late to do this for some reason and the Italians were a bit upset with us about this. Um, social distancing was then required and they put the one meter distant rule in place. March 9th marks the first day of lockdown for all of Italy and we were all required to stay inside at this point only leaving for necessities like groceries work or health if you do leave you must carry official documents stating your purpose for travel these are our documents given to us by the u.s air force and they have changed a few times with the decree changing over time as well these trucks were driving around all the towns reminding people to stay inside as much as possible and to only leave again for work health or groceries and if you do leave you need to carry the proper documentation the most recent development is requiring us to wear a mask and gloves at all stores and they're even stopping some people at the gate and asking their purpose for entering the u.s air force base the sense of community in this country has remained strong um, throughout this whole experience some people took to their balconies to sing or play music and others made posters like these and hung them outside which mean everything will be fine. Um, and then some people even went outside and clapped for our medical staff. And um, we are still having deliveries to our homes. So there's still a lot to be thankful for. Okay, Emma, what do you want to do today? Um. <laughs> Yes, of course, we're going to make cookies. What else do you want to do? Mama, mama. Sure, yeah, we can, we can read Brown Bear, Brown Bear again.
in the end, um, you know, we still can order food and I even had wine delivered from my favorite winery. Um, so everything will be fine. <laughs>